Alright guys, we've got a can crusher here we made a few years ago. Uh, had a lot of requests to see how it was made, so we're going to pull it down for you today and uh, let you see how it's built and hopefully you can make yourself one. So we'll fold up the stand. Now you can see all the internals that were removed during the process. Unscrew the air switch. Remove the screws to the rear cover. Pull out the two R clips and then remove the cylinder pin. Now the mechanism is ready to be removed from its aluminium housing. This setup consists of an air supply, a momentary air switch and a pneumatic cylinder custom made from an old bicycle foot pump. It has three return springs set up on the cylinder to ensure it returns evenly and a collar to ensure that it is always centrally located in the outer housing. We use the foot pump's original rubber piston seal with a custom rod. Let's plug it in and see how it works. Now looking at the housing, it was made from 82mm or 3.25 inch aluminium irrigation pipe, sanded and then polished. All welding done on the unit was done with an oxy. This is the pipe that we start with. You can see we have made cuts into the pipe to align the entry and exit points for the can on either side of the pipe. We have welded in a base plate with reinforcement welded to the underside of it. Okay, now let's put it back together.